So if we have log x equals 3, the inverse form of this would be inverse log of 3 equals x. On the calculator, we just press second log to access the inverse log function. And notice it's the 10 raised to the blank power. So we just press 3 for this. So the inverse log of 3 equals 1,000, which means in this case x equals 1,000. In the next example, log p equals 4.7. So the inverse log of 4.7 equals p. We repeat the process, so we press second and log, and then enter the number 4.7. So the inverse log of 4.7 is 50,118.72336. Now, last example, log z equals 4 would mean the inverse log of 4 equals z. We repeat the process, pressing second and log to access the inverse log function and enter 4 and then z equals 10,000.